Hello everybody, welcome back to AI War 2. Faction Frenzy now ready for the end game proper. We've got a few things to look at here though. One is that you can see our threat is down. It was just over 3k, now it's just over 2k. And a fair amount of that has beaten itself up here in Lurdorf. So let's take a look at this fight and just sort of see what's going on here for a bit. So we've got pretty much all Sentinel gunboats, over a thousand of them. There was close to 1300 at one point. You can see a lot of their shots are aimed towards our turrets that they don't like, especially the longer range ones. So we're just sort of trading shots with them. Hunter fleet comes in here every now and then, and so on. And they've been sending a lot more Sentinel gunboats slash sniper type units at us. And because of that, I want to counteract that a little bit better. Now to save some energy, I did knock down a bunch of plasma turrets. But also, I think we want to upgrade counteract that and I've thought about different things engineering metal generation more force fields would really help but minefields could be a thing um, you know disruptive don't quite have the research for it and I'm not using the plasma turrets as much so I'm not a big fan of just adding more of those the ships aren't that impressive even though I like the pike turrets concussion maybe not enough I think the best bang for the buck here is in generalist. We have quite a few gun bots and V-Wings. We'll get a lot more of those. I like the Ramifier frigates and then of course the sniper turrets to combat all of their Sentinel gunboats. And the jump from Mark 5 to Mark 6 on all of these, you get a significant boost in the numbers. And um, that should really help me fortify planets where I want to do that. So I'm going to go with that. And then our next little barrel of fun here is going to be to jump in here to Sycon as we see this building up the various ships. And the reason for that is I want to use the Dark Spire's help. This is the only homeworld that has an adjacent vengeance generator. Decently uh, upgraded there. Since the Dark Spire is hostile to us, if we get them in there, then anything they take out, the AI progress will not hit us. So it's sort of the enemy of the enemy is your friend situation here. Now, that's going to be a little bit tough because of how strong this is. The Dark Spire would have to escalate quite a bit more to do that, but I think it's potentially possible. I'd like to at least use that if I can. So I want to knock out this Dark Spire ward so that their ships aren't immediately vaporized. But in order to do that, I have to get through Anaris. That's my next goal. I want to move my support fleet into position here. Let's slide that over here. And then... To get in here, I want to deal with the golem first. So I'm just going to grab all of our strike craft, is the word I'm looking for. And let's go ahead and take those off attack move and get into this system. Boost the speed a bit. And that should be most of them. Yeah, they're already starting to be blown up. And over here is our artillery golem. There's a few guard posts around the system, nothing that we're concerned with relative to that. Let's take this thing down. All right, second one of those we've eliminated. Now let's bring all of the rest of the fleets in. Get our regen golem some work. And now we should have everybody in place. Let's see, we've got a shredder guardian. We've got a grenade launcher guardian. We've got a whole bunch of warden fleet. That's fun. Let's get rid of the guardians first. Generally a good plan. There's the shredder. Ah, oh, and they're running away. The warden fleet's running away, but the uh, Praetorian's coming in. They can't really decide what they're going to do. Let's clear out all of this mess down here. I have the same thought myself. Yes, sir. Okay, now where are we? 142 strength. That's not too bad. We have 251. We've clearly got the advantage. Let's try going pursuit and see how that goes. Our regen golem. At 90%. And by the way, this thing has upgraded now to Mark IV. I don't see it going much higher than that, just because of how long it would take. 
but it's got higher damage which allows it to tank bigger fights in terms of regenerating everything because it gains more health the higher its damage is due to vampires oh my goodness okay so maybe we are done doing that idea let's take out some of their force field guardians so bunch more warden and we've had some skirmishes with them lately but none of them favorable maybe here we can uh, turn around I hope oh boy but there's a lot of them okay more force field guardians looks like we've knocked out a bunch of them and you know what I think I just want to go attack move um, to somewhere right here around the edge of it let's just keep plowing through them we've still got more strength than they do though we might win this Let's see, coming attacks, nothing, nothing. Murdoch, but we should be okay there. And how are we in our adjacent system? Okay, 70 ships. As soon as we can, I need to come back in here and fight these off. But I think we might be okay in there for the time being. I'm going to bet on that. Let's get, get a more decisive advantage here first, if we can. Regen Golem's still doing great. So as long as that's the case. Boy, look at that escalating. We've got another another uh, instigator triggering more. We're still good, though. Okay, now I think we're sizable enough. Which fleet do we want to take out? Let's try Cadmium here. And let's switch them to different key number and put them on pursuit and load okay let's get that starship flagship whatever out of here there we go and so I want you to go in here and defend our support fleet everybody else stay in here and we are where not the view I wanted anyway. Okay, 89% still. Let's see, let's, um, let's knock out that Guardian and just hang out up here by the wormhole. Oh, they're running. Did we just beat the Warden fleet for the first time? I think we did. They're running away. Okay, Pursuit. And that wave's about to hit Murdoch, so we'll want to keep an eye on that. But I think we just want to clear everything out, knock out the guard post so that we don't have to worry about any sort of counterattack. Okay, and Murdoch, everything is fine at the moment. So, assuming those numbers stay good, we will be all set. Clearing out everything. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. They're bringing in more ships. Let's, uh, let's take a look over there, shall we? Pulsar tanks, vanguards, yuck. Okay, I want to get my, my engineers over here repairing this mass driver. So let's, um, let's go back in case they need to repair anything. But I might be okay in here. I've got a whole bunch of turrets up. But I think nothing really immediately needs my attention. So I'm probably best in being safe rather than sorry. Let's take our cloaked fleet. Because I don't have any defensive fleets around because I've been focusing on this expansion. So. Whoa, whoa, why is everybody leaving? No, no. I think I might have accidentally tr told them to go that way. Don't do that. You go back in here. And then, yeah, the ambush fleet. You come back to Murdoch. It's going to take you a while to get there. Everybody else, finish your job. We'll be in place on schedule. Which is in here. I think we're pretty much set. Okay, other attacks underway. Then this is all Hunter Fleet, which if they want to bash themselves against us, that's great. Looking okay at the moment. We can always build more if we need it. 
So let's see how Murdoch goes. Let's just watch this a bit. Oh yeah. They've got how many? Eat gads. That's not good. Yeah. So they're pounding that down pretty good. I'm definitely glad I sent the fleet back. Where is it? Okay. It's it's coming pretty close now. So we'll just follow that across. We can't do anything to help Murdoch until we get there. To Anibus. Zooms across to Murdoch. And now we're here. Let's go pursuit and unload. There we go. And now we should be fine. What about over in Lurdorf? Uh, nothing has changed. And we're gradually wearing them down. So back to Murdoch. Okay. And now we're cleaning this up pretty efficiently with the additional firepower. But that could have gotten iffy otherwise. Okay. Beautiful. Now go back to repairing. The mass driver, which will help with the next attack. And let's head back. Well, you know what? You should be able to stay here. Nope, I am going to need you over here. Forgot about that. Because I have a special plan back this way. I want the, where is it? The sniper fleet. Let's switch you to eight as well. Okay. So my plan here, let's see how much, how well it works, is to get those two fleets over here. Get them off pursuit. And of course, we're going to have to wait now for the other one to show up. It is annoying to try to reset instructions that don't want to work. And let's see where we are. Okay, we're coming through Secundus now. Maybe it'll work better if I do it one at a time. That seemed to do better than selecting them both, which is bizarre. But nonetheless, it did. Okie dokie, let's pop in here and see if we can make this happen. Our first visit. Whoa, I meant to pause that. A first visit to an AI homeworld. Let's uh, slow it down. Now, in here, oh, hi. How you doing? So that'll complicate things. Parasite guard post is covering us there. You're covering here, so I want to get up into this area, but the problem is the warden's here. I, I don't have a lot of time to stay, but uh, you know what? Let's just see how this works. Okay, now we're going to unload everybody, and then I want the long-range ships, the sniper and the tripper. And the idea is to be out of the range of everybody, and then have those two groups work on the Dark Spire ward. Come on, shoot. Yeah, there we go. We knocked it down. Those things aren't that powerful. Now, by good, for goodness sakes, get... Yeah, you're, you're almost dead now. Get out. And there it goes. It's dead anyway. So, we're going to lose a whole bunch of these ships. But we don't really care. Because we survived... We got down the Dark Spire Ward, so the Spire has a chance of surviving on that planet. And now we need to move all the way across the galaxy because it's time to pound our path through to Zombri. Sort of the procrastinating and working on other things and trying to strengthen and all of that. Well, it's over for the time being. It is time to see if we're ready to take that mess on or not. The fights over here in Rhea and Twofold to get in here were not that exciting. So I'm just going to head straight to the main event and get started at least at our assault on Zombri. We did free up uh, Tesla, the Dyson Sphere, although 
we've got you know more attacks coming. There's a bit of a fight going on in Zanzibar. Those are all Pike Corvettes. We're doing okay guarding, and I did split up my fleets a little bit here. Uh, group 7 is our main ones. Group 8 is the snipers in case I want to target them separately. And then group 3 is just sort of the reserve ones. They're going to hang out here in Tufel with our regular support fleet to help with the attack. Everything's cleared out in here for the moment. Now in Zombri, really old intel that we're looking at here. So it should tell us, though, what we got for guard posts. We've got two spiders, a gravity... Nucleophilic, Heavy Beam, Shredder, 4 to Thetis. Not a big fan of that. And then if we look at some of the ranges of the close-by ones, Gravity doesn't reach very far. Spider right about up to the wormhole. Uh, to Theta doesn't get that far. Spider, okay, so this is the main one that I have to be concerned about. And of course, it's going to be protected by that. Yeah, so that could get ugly. Tufel here is our entry point and what I think I need to do I've got all the ships out because I don't want to deal with the six second uh, penalty for being able to fire once you unload once you come in and in the battle in there there was Praetorian Guard that kept fleeing back through this wormhole so they could be anywhere in the system but they also could be close by so for the moment I just want to get everybody in and then see what we can make of this we've got less than 300 strength and now we're in a little bit, and they have almost 800. Okay, so clearly we aren't going to win this. Let's just see if we can take on anything crucial. Like, for example, enough stuff that we can get back through the wormhole. That might be all that we even can ask for during this uh, initial foray. Okay. So let's see. I think if I target the Tachyon Sentinels, is actually a decent idea. Although I want the sniper to see if you can do anything to that spider guard post. Two and a half million shields. I don't know if you could do enough damage in the time we have. Let's see. Because if I attack this, then any force field protecting it is the idea. What on earth? You're all leaving. Okay, that's fine. Takes it down to about 600 resistance strength. Okay. Now let's get rid of some of these... Guardians in the area. Yeah, let's get rid of that thing. Okay. Force field guardian stack of two. That sounds like a great thing to basically make go away. Except when it pops the shield back up and doesn't let me. Where are we at on our uh, regenerator goal? I'm still at 93%. Good. Okay. That's down. Tractor Guardian, Force Field Guardian. Keep targeting that. And how are we doing on this? Not getting very far. You know what? Let's just have them attack the same thing. I really want those Force Field Guardians down. There we go. Let's see. There's a. Let's have the snipers maybe just hit the Guardians that are a little further away. And then what do we even want to try to hit here? Anti-player zombie, sure. They took over one of our ramifiers. Um, I don't like the look of that. Suppressor frigate, tractor guardian. Okay, another tractor guardian. Now let's see, what kind of range do you have? Pretty good, you're going to be able to hit us all. And Oh, here comes a force field guardian. Hmm. What kind of ship strength do we have left? Well, a lot of it. And we actually should have more than that. I'd like to take out the heavy beam guardian, but I'm wondering about this force field guardian getting in the way. I think I'm going to risk it. Everybody. Well, let's have the snipers. Yeah, we're going to need everybody to do it. Everybody go after that. Okay, you're about to be gone. Yeah, so you escape and repair. Here comes the force field guardian. 
Yeah, and it's going to get in here before we can. See, my main concern is just being able to get out. I probably can get the flagships out, though, and then retreat everybody else later. Come on, knock it down. Knock it down, almost through the shield. There we go. Uh, we are at 58% on the golem. Thirty-eight percent. Boy, it's going to be close. I don't think we're going to make it. Come on, get rid of it so we can go. There it is. Gone. Okay, now everybody out. Get out. We're going to take a counterattack. This we know. We don't care. Get over there, regen golem. Oh, and he didn't quite make it, so that was added. That we could have done without. Okay. And hi, friends. There's a whole bunch of 145 strength, so we're going to have a nice big brouhaha in here. Won't this be fun? Can we even fight them off? I think we can fight them off. We're going to find out. 188. Okay, let's have you... Let's see, let's have you work on... Oh, we're not even going to be able to work on him because he's got a... Yeah, because so much of this stuff has to repair. So we're trying to repair whatever we can. But we're winning. Okay, we're let's just speed this process up. We are winning this fight. It's just going to take a while. But I'd rather clean out a bunch of ships here than back in Zombri, so... I mean, I'll take it. Just making sure that they keep... Their numbers keep going down. We don't have problems anywhere else. We're going to get a counterattack of almost 100 strength. I think that's worth what we accomplished. Here's a nice big wave against the Marauders. They have a nice strong system on the other side. Are we... Yeah, the Regenerator Golem is coming back up, which is nothing but good for us. We had full metal when this started. Okay. Yep, and 100 strength in their ships. But I think I think we definitely gave better than we got on that attack. So now what are we going to do? Well, that's pretty self-explanatory. We're going to heal up. And we're going to go after it again. With a similar approach, but we'll be targeting different things. All right, it's time for take two. They did spawn a new instigator base, which is boosting, I think they're just spawning threat ships directly. Uh, but overall, we did reduce quite a bit. This was up close to 3K again, uh, the threat by that first attack. And uh, over, I think we did get rid of uh, one of the dyers. So let's see what's left in here. And I put all of my sh four fleets under one flag, one uh, group this time. Let's see if we can do anything useful here. Okay. Whoops, not what I wanted. Okay, so they have a dire pike guardian. They have more dire guardians. They have a pike, a widow, a plasma, and a force field. How fun. So yeah, I think that's my goal here. Make make a bunch of their dire guardians go away. Like the force field one. And where are we at? 92% already. Okay, and once again, more hunter fleet running away. And the total strength in here is higher than it was before. So that's not good. It's obviously going to take quite a bit to wear them out. Okay, what do they have left? Pike, Widow, Plasma, Force Field, which is... There's the Force Field. Okay, that's what we're hitting now. Let's get rid of that. And then see where we are. Okay. 
So that's gone. They have a plasma. That's down here. I'm not too worried about the plasma per se. We have no big ships acquire shields. I definitely don't like the Widow Guardian. Let's go after that. There we go. Good grief, they already crippled the regen golem. Well, we have quite a few ships left, but yeah, I still think that's it. I think we get out and uh, see what we can do next time. There's another 200 strength counterattack. Don't care what's going on in here. Okay, this will be even easier than last time. So yeah, let's clean up and try again. Let's see if we can do anything better. Yanaka is under pressure. We're going to hope that it survives. There's nothing in there that absolutely has to be defended. And I sent a few vanguards in at the beginning here just to maybe have a little bit better entry. I also want to lower the speed down to normal here and do something sensible. Now, what dire... <laughs> I think they're just getting worse. But dire plasma is the only dire they have left. So that at least is something. Let's try to get rid of that. And more hunter fleet leaving. Pushing us out of the way. And how are we doing? Whoa! Good grief. That is insane how fast that happened. I didn't want to let him even get down. Good grief. Okay. I'm going to leave again and not let this get any higher, but there's absolutely blasting my entry point and uh, the regen golem. They're out of dyers, but we've got to find a way to handle that initial surge better. Maybe we just pop in and then pop back out? I don't know. A human resistance cell has engaged the AI. Yeah, and they've got a whole bunch of tractors and stuff trapping us. How much is in here? 120. Okay. So I may have to experiment with a different approach, but we seem to basically be at a stalemate. Like, the attacks are not presenting such counterattacks that we can't clear them out, but at the same time, I don't know that we're making any progress either. So I'll have to puzzle over that. But I'm going to sort of leave it on a cliffhanger here, and we'll try to figure out how to deal with Zombri next time. This is a fight that we must figure out how to win. Tell them thanks for watching, everybody. More AI War 2 coming up soon.